was over, they thought I was finished, dawg Whole city jump behind me, now I get more racks than a tennis ball And you know ain't no looking back, the streets brought the hustle out of me I was sick of eating pot of me, ramen noodles all through the week The struggle was ugly, made something What it do, what it do, YouTube? Send that shiver boy man out here today Sunday morning before it rain it's supposed to start raining today sometime you know this Memphis weather going by the app it's supposed to be rained at, at 8 o'clock man so it's 9 30 and it's still looking nice out here so what I'm gonna do I'll show y'all what we're working with today man man when I came out here the other day scooter out of town scooter was out of town I changed his oil and stuff man uh I check I always be checking my fluids so I check the fluid on the antifreeze, man. And I noticed that there's green antifreeze in here. And Hondas require a certain type of antifreeze, you know, for the uh, for the Asian cars, it requires the blue. I put blue back in when we redone the, uh, the element, man. We put blue back in there. Jonas redone his element, put blue back in his system, man. And Hondas, Hondas require the blue, so I noticed that, that this one has green in it, man, and I'm going to flush. I'm about to flush this out. I talked to a few of the homies, you know, to go over, make sure what I was about to do was right. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to uh, pull the drain plug on the, uh, I'm going to pull the drain plug on the radiator. It's down, you know, you can't see it from here, but it's down at the bottom of the radiator. I pull the drain plug. Uh, I'm going to disconnect this hose from the radiator i'm going to disconnect that one i'm gonna hold it up i'm actually run the water hose through the motor i'm gonna disconnect this one i'm gonna disconnect this clamp and hose because that's the one that comes out uh oh yeah that's the one that comes out and uh i'm gonna run clear water through here through the uh through this hose right i'm gonna run clear water through here through the motor i'm gonna turn crank the car up it ain't gonna take long to run that through run some clear water through there and once i see the water coming out right here and it's clear i'm good i'm good to go i can stop that let it run for a minute get all that water out cut the car back off cool the system is clear yeah, it's clear uh water running through it i got everything out and once i pull the drain plug this is gonna drain through the bottom all the antifreeze will, uh drain through the bottom of the radiator so i'm gonna run the water hose through here flush it out make sure all the all the uh everything coming out at the bottom is clear then i'm gonna seal it up man put the hose back on put that hose back here and uh close the drain plug up then we're gonna start filling up, man. I'm gonna I'm probably go and elevate it. I'm gonna probably elevate it, bag it up a little bit, elevate it in the air, you know, so it can burp. You know, they say when you burp a system, some people say, you know, they just they just let it run while the cap is off, and you will see it start to burp, you know, bubbles and start to burp. But some people say it's better to elevate the car. You know what I'm saying? Uh, put the car at an angle, and it helps to burp it too. So we'll see. Um, I'm gonna let y'all see what I do, man. I'm gonna try to prop the camera up over here and just talk to y'all. And I might do a time lapse, I don't know. So, give me a minute. We're gonna do this, man. Like I told you, I do certain things myself if it's not too complicated for me. And this don't seem like a complicated job, so we about to get it done. Matter of fact, once I pull this plug, pull this plug, and pull that hose, I might just run. No, I'm gonna let it, I'm gonna clear everything, then I'll run because I haven't got the antifreeze yet. Uh, so once I pull it and clear it and everything, then I'll run and get a couple jugs of, uh, of the blue antifreeze I'm telling y'all about. I'll show y'all when I go in the store and y'all will see what I'm talking about. But keep it locked, man. Go on get this started. All right. All right, y'all. So the first thing I'm gonna do, man, I'm gonna drain this drain plug. Wife, keep him up, Derek. I'm gonna drain this this antifreeze out of here. Don't let him come back here. Yeah, man. We gotta watch out for little G, man. 
Oh, little G will be trying to get back here with daddy. Uh oh. I'm trying to put my light down here so I can drain it. Just a little plug you pull out. The plug actually stays in, I think. Uh oh, no, I don't. Uh oh. <laughs> oh, God, <gosh>, shooting out. <laughs> I thought the plug stays in. Yep, yeah, so what we gonna do? We finna go ahead and run some water through it, son. Now. Okay. It's getting very clear. It's getting very clear now. now. Oh, it's clear now, y'all. It's clear now. Uh oh. <laughs> Pulled the level the wrong way. <laughs> I done wet my shades up, man. I done wet my specs up, man. I done wet my specs up. It's still pulling a little green. You'll see where it get clear. Then it pull a little more green. Yeah, it's just some green still draining. Yep, do it a few times. Alright. Yep, yep, we're gonna do that a few times. About two more times, should do it. Drain out, then we're gonna. We might as well go and pull this hose off right here. Pull this hose off, get my needle nose. I gotta give me some long needle nose. I'm gonna put that on my list too. Give me some long needle nose and the ones with the angle on it. The ones with the angle on that side. channel locks that'll work better than you need to okay I got it off I got it off y'all so pull this off uh, this my this is gonna come from the engine here okay and now I come out Right there. So I'll take this top one off. And I don't think I got no channel locks in there. I need to put some in that tool bag anyway. Put some channel locks in there. Be much better than these uh these needle nose. the car up and we're gonna run water through here and it'll run through the motor get all that out and it's gonna come out right here on the bottom side of this uh yes that's the water pump thermostat right there where the thermostat is or whatever we're gonna run that out right there so i'm gonna try to prop it up so y'all can see what i'm doing Hold on. Yeah, it might be. Y'all should be able to see it though once I flush it. I don't know how the sound is gonna be, you know, before I crank this car up. So that's what y'all have to uh excuse. You'll have to excuse the sound, man. But I am finna crank the car up and I'm gonna run some water down through here and try to go and flush it. Uh my boy, I was talking to my boy this morning, Jonas. He said he said it take a while for these hunters to warm up anyway. 
you you like P is not gonna warm up as fast as you think it is, man. So you know, I just be kind of, kind of, kind of. I'm gonna say scared to do certain thing, man. He like, nah, man, go on ahead, run that water through there, flush it out, and uh, it's gonna be real quick. And uh, once you get it out, man, just cut it off real quick. Go get your antifreeze, come back, then start filling it back up. So that's what I'm about to do, man. I'm finna crank it up. Hope the phone don't fall. Hope the, hope the camera don't fall. It shouldn't, though. I thought it would. I thought it would come out the motor right there good. It didn't though. I'm gonna do it one more time, man. Do it one more time. Thermostat got a hope. Yeah, once the car warm up. Okay, I'm 
Center. Still good. It's just now getting up to the seat. cut it off and come right back but I'm gonna hook I'm gonna hook uh the hoses back up and I'm just gonna no nah, I ain't gonna run it through here but quite a bit came out like it's some still coming out but no I don't wanna run it through there but I can though I can I can hook both of the hoses back up and then still run it through the radiator run it through the radiator We'll be right back. All right, y'all. We finna put the uh, put the drain plug back in. Hold on. Uh, hold on. Yeah. Gonna put the drain plug back in. draining a little bit right there at the motor Ooh, I try not to burn my arm boy it's close I need to go to Harbor Freight too DJ came over the other day man he had some nice little uh he had some nice little uh wire cutters man I'm gonna get them wire cutters yeah man now we're gonna put the uh put this drain plug in. Uh, gotta put that baby in without without burning my arm uh, up against this little manifold here. Okay, we got the drain plug back in. Now we're gonna plug these hoses back up. It's still draining out the motor, so we're gonna let some of that come on up. Still come up out that motor. Ain't nothing but a little bit. But what I could do, hook both of the hoses up, run some water through the system, and still let it all come out through the uh, radiator. Put the shooting in there, it's gonna come back out. Could do that. But we'll see. We'll see. I'm gonna let this finish draining. Because it's still coming out. So what I might do, I might run on to the parts though. But this is dripping out pretty good, man. Let that finish draining. That's what I'm gonna do, man. We're gonna go to the parts though. Get the antifreeze and come back. Jump in the element. Let's ride, y'all. What to do, what to do, man. Yeah, I just had a couple more things added to my plate today. What I gotta get done. But yeah, I know I'm gonna I'm gonna pull up on my boy. I'm, I'm headed to get the antifreeze now, y'all. But once I'm done with this, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and crank the four-wheel up, man. 
My boy just told me he finna come on and get the four-wheeler, man. I've been sold my four-wheeler, y'all, a few days before Christmas. It just still been, you know, here at the house with me. But uh, he just told me to go ahead and prepare it and, you know, crank it up and stuff and get it ready for him. So that's what I'm going to do as soon as I get back and fill Scooter car up and letting it run and everything. I'll go ahead and crank the four-wheeler up. But, yeah, that's what we finna go ahead and say our farewells to... to uh, to Ruby, man. Say our farewells to Ruby. So, the next little toy project is is, is, is definitely not going to be another four wheeler. It's going to be a golf cart, man. I won't be a golf cart, and I'm just going to wait to the right sign, the right deal come through, and everything. And I'm going to get me a golf cart. Y'all know, y'all know how I am, man. When I got my mind set on something, you know, uh, 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 I'll make sure it happens. You know, at least I at least I work towards. That's okay. I work towards making it happen. But the first thing we got to do, y'all, what? We got to speak it into existence. Hold on. Got to lay down with it. Man. Trying to do it with one hand, boy. You got to lay down with it. But yeah, man. You got to speak it into existence, first of all, man. So, so yeah. We're going to get us a golf cart. Just waiting on the right deal, baby. Waiting on the right deal. Man, we're going we gonna to get it. Either probably instead of paint it, we'll just get it wrapped. Wrapped is easier, man. Get it wrapped. Put some wheels on it, music on it. I don't know if I'm gonna go the lifted look with the bigger tires or go go uh just the regular stock height with some low profile tire like street tires on it. I don't know which way I'm gonna go yet, but that is one of my uh, other projects that I will be doing, man. And uh, my boy, he getting a good four wheeler. He getting a go good four wheeler. You know, I had it, I had it snorkeled, I had it uh, radiator relocated. Um, it has a lift kit on it. it. Has a two or a three inch lift, I think a three inch high lifter lift on it. It has a, uh, I think I got twenty eights. The tires, I think I got twenty eights on. It. I don't think I got thirties on. It. I got twenty eights on it. Aftermarket wheels, fourteen inch wheels. And that's about it. I got a light bar on there. Got the light bar. Got a winch. I got a winch on there too. So I know you're getting a good four wheel. I hadn't rode it in a while, so once I crank it up and, and pull it out, I might run around the block real quick. I might run around the block real quick, man. But I'm on a on a tight schedule, man. Cause I gotta go holler at my boy before he go to work. We finna throw them HIDs in my uh in my in my element man i've been having my LED, i mean leds we're gonna throw the leds in there he got the same kind he already know what to do so i'm gonna pull up on him he put the same ones in his element he the one told me where to get mine from so he was telling me how how tight one side is gonna be it's gonna be real tight and you gotta watch how you put them back in because it's like a spring that holds it to keep the resistance on it i said you know what bro i'm gonna pull up on you i'm just gonna pull up on you man we're gonna slap them in so we gonna go ahead and get that done today too. And after that, you know, if it ain't raining or nothing, it's still clear, man. That's when I'm gonna make my Harbor Freight. Make my Harbor Freight run, man. Run out there and get what I need out, out there in Harbor Freight. Yep, so keep it locked. We pulling up at the parts store right now, man. Pulling up at the parts store. I think it's behind this cover. Behind that cover right there. Right there. I'm gonna have to figure out what that is. It's, it's irritating to me. It's irritating. But let's run in here, man. Get this. I see that cup holder. Can I show y'all my cup? How I spruce my cup holder up? I feel that hole up. I think I did. If I didn't. I, no, nah, I don't think I showed y'all. But yeah, these rubber inserts, you know, this one wasn't in there. These two weren't in there when I got it. So I ordered some of these offline. And then, you know, this has a natural hole right here because this came out of F-150 with the gear shift in the floor. With the gear shift in the floor, right? So some people use it for different things. Some people put a Walmart bag in there and cause take this trim off and hold it with a Walmart bag like a little trash bag. Now, I ain't that nasty. When I get out, I'm taking stuff out with me. So I ain't, I ain't gonna say nasty. I'm, I'm not, I don't have that much trash in my car, put it like that. 
But uh, this one right here, I think it fits up. Uh, I forgot what vehicle, but I be in them groups and them forums on um, on Facebook, and man, it fit down in there perfectly enough to not rattle and loose enough to pull out if I had to use my emergency brake. But my emergency brake is still down there, y'all. Yeah, emergency brake is still down there. So, man, I keep that in there. And as soon as I post it in the group, they, man, that's a lot of cup holders. Man, I almost cursed, cursed dude out, man. But see this one, I'm using this for my, my GPS, for my uh, stand. I had an extra one of these in the garage. Use that for my, my uh, phone stand. Uh, and of course, I'm gonna be using these for like just holders. You know what I'm saying? Like whoever on the passenger side, this theirs. And this right here, this this my cup holder and my whatever, whatever I want to put in. You know what I'm saying? Well, folks gonna have something to say. He probably was mad because I I did it before he did. You know what I'm saying? Keep it locked, man. All right. Yeah. So we gonna, we going in. We looking for this uh. We looking for this uh antifreeze, man. Should I just say all vehicles? We ain't going with that. We're going right here. It's a little bit higher, but it's for the Asian vehicles. So you got different. The green is Hyundai, Kia, Nissan, Mazda. The red is Toyota, Lexus, Scion. You can use the, this is the blue, what I use. 50 50 already uh, pre diluted. No need to add water. This for Honda, Hyundai, Nissan, Subaru. So I don't know if we need by, us, by both of us having a Honda. I will, I'm gonna go ahead and grab two. I doubt if it take the whole two, but I'm gonna go ahead and grab. I'm gonna go ahead and grab two of them. So $23 is $46. So it's gonna be every bit of $50, 50 something like that. Yeah. Yeah, it was 50 46 y'all i ain't that thing clean but sometimes i just gotta stand back up off of it sometime man stand back up off of it and admire it man oh. now i see them doors we call this the hood culling man it's our culling you got the rose rush culling and then you got the honda culling man Yeah, you got the Honda color in. See how it close up? <laughs> we'll be back. We'll be at the house, man. Alright, alright. Had to go in there and get the four wheeler key. I'm gonna set that over here. I'm gonna crank it up once I get this going. I went and got my channel locks, man, so we finna put this hose back on. Put this hose back on right there. Move the channel locks. Put the clamp back on. <laughs> Boy, I just be thinking about stuff, man. Make you laugh sometime. You know how some people say you laugh to keep from crying? I laugh. I laugh to keep from snapping on a, on a mug. I laugh to keep from snapping on a mug sometime, man. For real. All right, we got that one back on. Put this one back on. We got the plug in already. And, man, we just finna, uh, we finna run this, uh, Run this blue antifreeze up in here. Man, I know these gonna be locking. Now, how you unlock? Come on, man. Come on, man. Oh, I hate these clamps. Here, you give me a regular old screw clamp. Man, 
mean, come on, dog. <laughs> Come on, bro. There you go. What you gonna say, man? About to, about to piece, about to piece me off. Don't do that, man. Don't do that, cool. Alright. I don't go that far around. Uh -uh, I locked it again. <laughs> I locked it again, man. There we go. Alright. Shout out to y'all, man. They be they, they show me my support and Y'all really rocking with me, man. Rocking with the movement. What I got going on. Y'all see I incorporate my family, everything in here, man. It ain't just about the my material things. You know what I'm saying? It ain't just about that. So, alright. I'm gonna fill the radiator up first. Then we'll keep going from there. I wanna got my funnel too. I wanna got my funnel. So I won't make as much of a mess. Got my funnel. <clears throat> Got the first jug right here. Then we're gonna crank the car up. We're gonna crank the car up, man. <clears throat> we're gonna get started on this. We're gonna get started on this, man. It's not a real big radiator, so it's not gonna hold a whole lot. That's why I said we may not even need both of these jugs to hold. I know we won't need both of them to fill the system up, but uh, we'll have extra, man. If we, since me and him got a Honda, baby girl will be getting a Honda soon. Once she get her license, she'll be getting she getting a Honda too. She want a Honda Accord, man. So that's what we gonna get her. Yep. See this 50 50 already diluted. See how it's blue? I don't know if y'all can see it on there. But it's blue, man. And that one number green I just I just got up out of here. I'm gonna have to wash this ground down good too. Once we done. All that antifreeze, man. No, y'all, it's taking quite a bit of this first jug. It's taking quite a bit. And once I crank the car up, it's gonna go on, on in there. So I don't know, we might use a, a jug and some of the other ones. Mm-hmm. Hold on, I think I stopped it just in time, in the right, in the nick of time. Before it overflowed, let's see. No, I'll take that back. Still taking it. It's getting close though, because you can hear it. It's getting close to the top. Come on, man. They're gonna take this whole jug for sure. Okay, I hear it. Coming to the top, it's starting to gurgle. Oh, it's starting to gurgle. So we're gonna crank the car up. 
after this first one. It definitely took a whole gallon. Definitely took a whole gallon, y'all. So hold on, let me crank the car. We'll be right back. Bro, Big Mike, Big Mike told me, make sure I turn the, uh, make sure I turn the, uh, the heater on. So I turn the heater on. So once that thermostat start opening, the, the heater's gonna get cold, gonna get hot. And then, just let it run, it'll burp. The system gonna burp. We should be good. Yo, I'll put the headset on. That's all I need to get. I'm my wife, honey. Yeah. I was going to take one day to the house. Who? In the back of the building. Okay. I just, I just, I feel, I just actually crunk it up right before you call. I feel the radiator up first. And I just, I'm just trying to see. Yeah, I'm 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 trying to see. Yeah, I don't know why the plan is still coming on. Good. Doing a whole lot. Don't matter if I did it right. I'm gonna show you how I did it. I took both of them. I took that top right there to hold off. Okay. I took that hose off right here. Okay. Yep. So that sucks. That on that thread. Okay. Okay. So that's what I was saying. The motor probably I didn't let it get hot enough for the thermostat to open. Okay. So I was running water through it. It was like one time. It was barely coming out of here. It's like a thermostat. Yeah. Uh, yeah, but you're going to keep it pretty good, though. So I got enough of it out. Okay. okay. The same. Yeah. I hope you yeah. The pump is a little bit. Dang. Yeah. But reservoir. I'm gonna have to let that green out there now. Ah, let's go. Put that boat loose and put it in the Right here? Yeah. And some of them will slide up. Some got a thing to slide up. Make the holes a little lower, start pushing off here the block. Well, you could have put some of that where you drain it, filled it up, and oh, push some in to the hole through. Feel that way to push it, push all that in the block first. Mm -hmm. This is when it's been a high lower here. 
that's what, well, that's like what I have, how I have that sloth and stuff doing, doing, so you don't have the same conventional <laughs> reservoir. You know, we did, uh, did my stuff like that. Yeah. I had had to do my stuff, my country like this. Even though it, it feels too right here, because y'all, we still have to put their coops in the block. This is like I'm doing a water pump, mm -hmm. or doing a, uh, just doing like water pump or right there, or stuff like this. Yep. So, you had your one, you'll, you'll understand. I, I, I say, I've been for four thousand, you got dog. Yeah. It's like you smell it, but it's worse when you step in. Yep. What it do, man, y'all? See, I'm un, I'm un, uh, uncovering old Ruby, man. Y'all know I barely crank it, but it should crank right up because I got my, uh, my battery sent on. Should crank right up. About to come and pick it up, man. Right on the edge. Definitely dirty. Look, should fire, it should fire right up, man. I don't see no inch covering this joint like it used to be. I might watch it for him before he comes. That right key. Yeah, both of them go through it. Okay. Supposed to. Pull the choke on that thing. Uh-oh. What's going on? Something ain't lighting up. It's supposed to light up, man. You better turn the plug up. Hope it is up there on the wall, man. I got my jump pad, though. I ain't worried about that. Uh-oh. Don't get no wrecks and then got hold to them. Ain't hit nothing. Let me go get my jump pad. Go get my jump pad. All right, y'all. So, it was Denley, my cord. But no, the better thing. It's slowed up. My cord running from so that, but we got power now, y'all. We got power. Pull the choke for a minute. Yeah, man, see it been snorkeled, ready to relocate. Gotta clean this joint out, I ain't got much on that. Yeah, I gotta clean it out. Uh, 
aftermarket wheels, you got a lift on it. Yeah, just dirty. I wanna say this is 28, I think. Huh? I don't know, Kevin. You put 30s on yours. Yeah. I thought I had 28s. Nah, I got 30s. I got 30. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I, I thought I had 28 for some reason, man. Yep. So. Yeah, I probably, I probably be broke when you saw me on 30. Cause I knew yours would hold it, cause yours got a, you got a newer yeah, model too. Independent. Yeah, and, and yeah, independent uh, suspension. Let me see, see if it'll crank back up. That's crazy. Just probably like you said though. Them cat got a hurt. Yep, turn that light on. Yep, hopefully that battery's good for them. That battery high. That little old battery, man. I know they're about $80. I paid a little bit over $100. I think like $119 from Walmart. Oh, ah, okay. Something like that, because I was mad when I bought it. <laughs> like, man, God, that little old battery caught that much, man. Imagine the dude with the ride lawnmowers, man. Man. Yeah, you have to go through this. Right. I'm ready today. I got a battle with mine. Huh? I'm ready today. I got a battle with mine. Yeah. Oh, you're saying something. When I bought this. You're getting something. You're getting something. Like you had new batteries. Man, new batteries. $75. Yeah, he just got this little tool right here. He's going to pull all in uh, and he, he had a whole lot of stuff right here. He looked at it to see if he did anything. He got the price on that. So, okay, he looked cool. Yeah. But we're going to let it run for a while. We're going to let it run for a while, man. And uh, I'm going to clean it on out. We'll be back, man. I got scooter. I got scooter. Uh, car still running. The temp looking good on it. Temp still looking good. Not even made it up to half, and it been running all this time. And it hasn't went down anymore. So it's still in the same spot. So I think we're gonna be good, man. We're gonna be good. Keep it locked. Yeah, he finna. I'm gonna throw them bulbs in for me, man. I told y'all I'm gonna pull up on him. He's gonna throw my HIDs in. I mean, my LEDs in. Yes, sir. Yeah, it's cool. You see? It's cool? Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Camera? Yes. Camera, yeah. Yep. So, we're gonna put these joints in, man, so we can be a little, we can be a little brighter at night i gotta adjust my driver's side one well, i gotta see how to adjust it it's uh, kind of pointing down it's pointing point down further towards the ground i'll look it up on youtube you used to have some little screws on the top but i don't see them but we'll get them though keep it locked y'all i'll show y'all the difference once he put that one in I'm gonna show y'all the difference how this how one of them brown one of them gonna be like a like a cool blue bright white cool blue color all right Look at my boy ryan got it got him a el camino where you going man where you, where you <laughs> huh y'all see this y'all see this el camino man clean thing i'm gonna have to get it on the channel man i'm gonna have to get that joint on the channel See, what it do, what it do, man. Yeah, we couldn't, uh, we didn't get the headlights in, man, because my my partner, he, uh, he ended up going, running out of time, man, because he actually had to be at work. He had to be at work at a certain time, man. He had to finish, get himself together for work. And I really went over there, like, last minute. He told me to pull up. But them joints, uh, them joints ain't easy. They ain't just, you know, push in and twist it, man. It got, like, a little 
a little clamp that come behind the light that holds the light in you got to put the clamp back in right and excuse me and, and, and if you don't get that clamp right because the back of the led light is bigger than a factory bulb so you got to get pull that clamp around the led bulb and put the other ends back in there perfect man to where the hook and and it, you gotta you gotta finesse it man so that's why i didn't even fool with it in the first place he told me how hard it was and he couldn't even get the easy side in plus he was working against you know the heat he, he looking at the watch it's time for, almost time for him to get himself together to go to work so we just said we're gonna try to knock it out another morning or something that we we're both free i'm not in no rush that's why they've been back there i ain't in no rush to put them in man so Right now, I'm gonna stop by Harbor Freight, get some a uh, couple of tools I said I needed. What'd I say? Uh, some wire cutters and some needle nose with the angle on it, some bigger needle nose with the angle on them joints. Give me some of those too. And whatever else I see that I may need, man. But yeah, Harbor Freight right here, and then I'm gonna stop by Academy Sports. And give me some ammo, man get me some ammo i might shoot to the gun range today man and if i don't i'm gonna go tomorrow but i got me a new toy you can't see it but it's back down the back seat in that in that t-shirt yeah man got got me a new got me a new toy man i'm gonna stop by and give me some ammo give me some uh some uh bullets for the for the range we'll get some regular bullets for the range get then give me some defense bullets for the house man so keep it locked. Man, it's air cold in this thing. Woo! Let me turn it down some. Good God. Yeah, man. We're going to do that. And then we're going to head back to the house, man, and finish up the things we got to do at the house before this rain come in. It's been holding off all day, too. It ain't rain yet, man. It's supposed to start raining at 8, 8 o'clock this morning. It's 2.30. So y'all keep it locked. Go up in Harbor Free. All right? Okay. I'm bouncing in my seven, my seven, my seven. I'm riding.